Almost nine months ago, I made a YouTube video about how the Xbox Elite Series 2 controller and the chat pad would be a great HOTAS alternative. Now everyone can afford to put down almost $1,000 on flight sticks, rudders, and desk mounts. And now all star system players want their desks to be occupied by a whole bunch of game accessories. I also shared my idea to CIG on their Spectrum Forum website. A few people in the community responded positively. Back then I knew there could be one of two reasons the chat pad didn't work. The Microsoft driver could be the issue or Star Citizen was the issue. First off, I want to give a shout out to Microsoft for not only creating the Xbox accessories application, but also keeping the app maintained. Through the app, users were able to submit feedback to Microsoft for improvements. At that time, the app would error whenever I would try to install a chat pad driver update. I sent them feedback and more likely other users did as well. Almost a year has passed and all that time I assume the issue remained the same. Two nights ago I stayed up almost until 6 in the morning diligently trying to find an alternative app that will allow players to assign keyboard keybinds to their chat pad. None existed for Star Citizen. I turned on Star Citizen and the issue remained the same. However, for some odd reason, the number one key on the chat pad worked. I closed Star Citizen and opened the Xbox Accessories app and attempted a firmware update for the chat pad. Voila, no error. So I went back into Star Citizen and all the keys on the chat pad worked. My keyboard keybinds work on the chat pad. Ladies and gentlemen, if you survive this long prologue, you now know you can use your Xbox Elite Series 2 controller and chat pad in Star Citizen. First off, you can use a regular Xbox One or Series controller, but I would suggest using an Elite Series 2 or future version of the gamepad because you need the additional four trigger buttons. This video is for people who are using a genuine Xbox controller and chat pad because the drivers may only be compatible to Microsoft products. First, if you don't have Xbox accessories installed in your PC, open the Microsoft Store app located in your apps list. Once open, search Xbox accessories in the store. Install it and open it you might have to sign in your Xbox account. I'm not sure if it's required, but make sure you install the Xbox application as well and sign in there. Maybe you only have to sign in once between the two apps. Make sure your genuine chat pad is connected to your genuine Xbox controller and connect all of it to your computer via USB. Once that's done, your gamepad will be displayed in the accessory app. Below your gamepad, the left button with the three dots called More Options, click on it. You will see a rectangle below your gamepad that says What's Attached Xbox Chat Pad. Click on it. On the next page to the left, there will be a firmware option to click on. If there are no updates available, then you don't need the update. As a reminder, everything I'm using are genuine Xbox products. There are plenty of chat pad options online to buy especially on Amazon, but I have not tested the alternatives yet. If you guys help me get over the 200 subscriber threshold, I'll buy an off-brand chat pad and see if the driver works on it. 